Alrighty. Good morning. Welcome to uh, refurbishing old rusty weights that I bought for way too much money. Thanks, COVID. So, what I'm going to try and do and document is I am going to try to refurbish some weights, some standard Olympic iron weights. So I will be uh, right back and I'll let you know how I'm gonna do this. Bye. Alrighty, welcome back, here we are. We have got my 45s, my 35s and my 25s in a solution of one part white vinegar, one part water, except for this. Honestly, this was kind of a hassle. Uh, it's hard to find a good container for your 45s, so there's probably a little bit more water than vinegar in here. Got about a gallon and a half of white vinegar in that one, and probably close to three gallons of uh, water, so we'll see how that one works out. But these are pretty much one-to-one -one on the money. Uh, this is the vinegar I'm using. Uh, pretty easy to find found it at the local grocery store three bucks a gallon uh, here's the weights beforehand they all pretty much look like this they're old they're rusted I have not touched them before I put them in the vinegar so uh, we're gonna leave this in here for about 24 hours it's about nine o'clock in the morning right now in California and uh, We'll uh, see how it looks in about a day from now. Peace. Alrighty, this is about 23 and a half hours. And we're gonna hit them with a little bit of water and then get the buffing wheel on them. Let's get to see if that uh, rust comes right on out. Something tells me it will, considering uh, I can just kind of go like that. And you can already see the surface rust coming off there. So uh, something tells me we're, uh, we're in the money here. Alrighty, here we have a little uh, before and after, just after hitting it with a wire brush. Uh, still can't decide if I'm gonna hit it with the grinder or not. Um, I'm tempted, but uh, if it comes out much better than that with the brush, I might just leave it. But uh, we'll see. Alrighty, and we decided to uh, hit this 25, both the 25s, with the uh, wire brush or the wire wheel. Uh, took uh, It took a minute and it's a lot of work, but uh, you'll see in the following pictures that the result is awesome. We are down to bare metal and we are ready for paint. Here's our 35s. Pretty, uh, 
pretty beat up looking plates. We're gonna try and get these back down to bare metal and prepped for paint. Alrighty, so we've got a hot brushed plate here next to an unbrushed plate and let's hit it with some water. Big difference after 24 hour vinegar water soak and about three minutes with the wire brush. All right, on to the next one and probably the grinding wheel too. Alrighty, good morning. This is, uh, let's see, about probably, well, probably about 36 hours for that bottom plate, about uh, 24 for the top. Soak for these 45 plates. Uh, as you can see, I actually had to dump the container over because there was no lifting those things out of there. They were sealed pretty good. So now we're gonna take a wire brush all that surface rust hit it with the uh, grinding wheel and these two shall be ready for paint Alrighty, we've got all the big plates hit front, back, sideways, and backwards uh, with the wire brush, grinding wheel, and of course the 24 hour vinegar water one to one solution. So now they're ready for primer, and uh, that is the next step. Huh, Daisy? Alrighty. Some uh, Ace Hardware brand Rust Stop Gray Primer. Dries in 30 minutes or less. And uh, the face of these plates are primered up. Give it about 45. Just to be safe, flip them over, do the backs, get the edges. Then it'll be time for color. Alrighty, we are all the way primed up. 35s, 45s, front, back, sides, and we have the first coat of paint down on the top of our 25s. Let that dry. Hopefully do the uh, back to the plates. Hopefully have the 25s done tonight and the rest done tomorrow. Alrighty, we're uh, pretty much done with our big plates now. And we're gonna move on to our uh, 10s, 5s, and 2.5s. Uh, as you can see, this one is uh, pretty beat up compared to what we've been looking at with the big weights and the progress that they've been making. Uh, these spent about 36 hours in the solution of vinegar and water. Um, as you can see by my hands and by this stuff, it's all just, it's coming right off. So I'm going to just hit these with the grinder, not even going to worry about the, uh, the wire brush. And, uh, these will clean up really nice and we'll see that process now.
batch of weights here, all primed up and ready for some color. All right, let's get to it. All righty, here we are. The finished product after a couple weeks of work they are ready to go up on the bar and uh, yeah that's the process of getting an old set of rusted out weights looking new and ready to use again thanks for watching